Now I know what you're thinking. Seguin? A tropical getaway? But it's true, just outside the charming town and nestled in the Guadalupe River's Lake Placid, you'll find a little retreat tucked away that's easy to get to but feels miles away from ordinary. Cross a bridge that feels straight out of the Amazon and you'll find yourself surrounded by palm trees, cabanas, and all other trappings of paradise on Suns Island. There's horseshoes and hammocks, folks getting out on the water and barbecuing on the shore, plus a volleyball court if you really want to reenact your favorite Top Gun scene. With so many options to choose from, I met up with Jeffrey King to get the full scoop. I do have to ask, how did y'all come up with this idea to create an island getaway? I did math about 120 miles away or from the nearest coastline. So really, uh, the fact that this island is so far away from the coastline and kind of far away from cities is what really draws people here. Um, our owner uh, worked in construction before and he's also done a lot of traveling. So he really wanted to combine the two and bring his construction knowledge and experience and really create something really beautiful and great that's just a tropical experience once you get out here. Uh, we've really got everything. We've got rope swings, we've got uh, frog slides, kayaking, paddle boarding. Um, really, you can come here and do as little as you want or you can do as much as you want. So Wonderful. Later in the day, you're going to show us how the glamping all goes down, but I'm ready to get in the water, so what do you say? Check it out. Perfect. In fact, on a hot day, getting into the water is just about the easiest way to cool off. And let's be real here, this is Texas, every day is a hot one. And with a water slide, a rope swing, whatever you call one of those floaty thingies, and so much more to choose from, there's no shortage of ways to beat the heat. Plus, there's fishing, space for folks to bring their own boats and jet skis, or you can just hang out and splash around. If you've never done this before, you totally have to. It's kind of weird, it's like you're on ground, but you're on water, hey. And you kind of get a little bit of a workout. Nothing too bad at all. You definitely have to try paddle boarding at Suns Island, a must. I like the rope swing, canoeing, paddle boarding, being with friends and family. Paddle boarded around, kayaked a little bit, so it's pretty fun. All right, now that we spent some time on the water and in the water, I'm building up a little bit of an appetite, so why don't you say we go back to the cabana and fire up the grill. And each of Suns Island's cabanas comes equipped with a grill and bar top for entertaining and makes for a great place to get out of the sun for a bit. So what are you doing out here today at Suns Island? Well, we were swimming and eating. That was probably the most funnest part. Turn up your favorite summertime playlist and it won't take long before you find yourself on island time, even if it is 3,616 miles to Hawaii, but who's counting? Plus, if you want to extend your daycation into a longer stay, you can try glamping at Geronimo Creek, which is kind of like all the fun of regular camping, just with none of the work. So here we've got our brand new glamping cabins, um, two queen size beds, and unlike traditional camping, these are fully air conditioned. Um, you've got a microwave refrigerator, direct TV, really everything that you need. Just like it's at home. You then have your deck area, your little patio section. You also have, like you said, a TV, microwave, the whole shebang, and air really, conditioning. Yeah, the, uh, the best part is, I mean, your footsteps away from the river. So come in here, chill a little bit, and then go right over the river, go swimming. So this is teepee number one at the Geronimo Creek Resort. Um, we have five teepees here, and they're all completely air conditioned. We've got a kitchenette two queen-size beds, um, a pull-out couch, so really you can sleep, depending on how comfortable you are with your partner, um, <laughs> up to uh, six people here. Air conditioning, you got a seating area, you have a whole kitchen area, get your cup of coffee, maybe sit down, have breakfast, and then step outside and enjoy the morning. Sounds. 